this is Marcia from Marcia's Fab Life and I have a primer call but um, it is accessories so I didn't get much glasses because um, I did buy a lot of glasses before and show you already um, before so I got uh, more accessories and stuff like that so I would like to just show you what I got from Primark so yeah I'm gonna start off with this little bomb bag yeah as you can see it's like a um, see-through bag if you get me it's like a mesh material and yeah this came as a rack sack as well and the rack sack was white and they also had a black but um i saw this little um bum bag as you would call it yeah it was um how much was it again this one was seven pounds for it as well but this yeah is really good because you know i told you like probably a few weeks ago is festival and things like that so this will be ideal you know to have so you can see what you got inside your bag basically but um if you don't want things on display that's fine but i just thought i'd show you this little bomb bag because yeah it's good for things like that so this here like i said was seven pounds for it um yeah so this is really good for that and you can put your keys your card and your phone i like the fact it's got um the little extra bit here as well so maybe you can put your little chewing gum in there maybe a bit of your money but um or your card yes um if you want it like that if i can zip it back up yeah just a bit stiff isn't it we, well i'm not gonna muck around with this anyway so i'm just showing you this so yeah seven pounds for this and yeah I think it is a good bar, but I just think this zip here is, might be a bit stiff. Maybe it needs to be worn in a bit. There's nothing wrong with that. Some bags go through those kind of things, you know. So, um, oh God, now these, no, they're not tangled up. Yeah, so I picked up these little um, sandals here. And these here was, how much was it again? Nine pounds. But um, I'm not too sure if I'm going to keep them because I really was after for like these kind of color tan sandals and stuff like that but I do like them you know it's like a string as you can see you can tie it up around your your leg but um yeah this here was nine pounds yeah nine pounds for it but I do like them but I'm not sure if it's going to be quite strong enough for me but they feel quite strong if you get what i mean see these have got like rubber sole which is good it isn't that kind of you know what i'm talking um that kind of plasticky kind of bottom if you get me so it's got a rubber sole so it's good but um i really do like these but i'm not sure if it's going to be strong enough because um yeah i'm big feet is about size eight or maybe seven it just all depends on the shoe and all the rest of it sometimes seven fit me and sometimes you know i need an eight you get me because you know i don't want my back foot really hanging off the shoe it's not really that great but i just wish that primark would have a lot more bigger sizes i've noticed there's just a lot of small sizes like size three and four and all the rest of it we need a little bit more bigger sizes please yeah it'd be nice i know which is good is they've got wide fitting shoes as well which is really good but i just i don't need that i just need my size you get me basically seven eight need to be a bit more if you get me because yeah i think it's better but i do like how it's quite comfortable as well on the sole it's quite soft actually so they'd be very comfortable but i'm just not sure about the strap how it is around here you see it's like string again but here it's fine but they're nine pounds which i think um it's a little bit more but then i understand because they're using a lot more string on it as well so yeah that's that for that and um I thought I'd show you these shoes here. I'll put them right. Can I put them right? So these here, I do like how this little pattern is round here. I think these are really, really nice. How much is this again? 
yeah i've got to check you now because i'm literally taking it straight out of the bag so these here was seven pounds which i think is quite good you know so they're nice flat shoe and i like how it's got the you know the the kind of dupe string kind of thing around the bottom i don't know what it's called but if you know what it is you can leave a comment what it is but i can't remember what it is and it's a rubber sole down the bottom but i do like the design it's quite different i do like them actually um yeah it's white they had it in um they had it in black as well so if you don't fancy getting the white ones like these they have them in black and I think it was black and this kind of, or a bit more lighter colour, yeah, for them. But I thought that was a good buy. And one thing that's good, it's got a little elastication there. So it stretches there so you can put your feet, feet, feet inside there comfortably. Yes, which is good. About £7. So that's that. I've got one more shoes and, and then that's it and I'm going to go moving on to the rest of the accessories and stuff. So I picked up these um, shoes here. I know they're very bright, aren't they? They're orange. They had these in a um, blue as well, which was nice, like a nice royal blue. They had that in and um, what was it blue, orange and pink as well. So, yeah, that's it. But I do like the detail of how it is. And I did slip these on. Um, so these fit me fine. So maybe if you're um, um, the actual size, you might need to go a side down. I don't know. Or maybe it's just me. But um, they fit fine. And like I said, very, very comfortable. Very cushiony. Which, yeah, is really good. I think Primer are really starting to... Um, be really good on the comfort you know because in the past I know their shoes are a bit comfortable but I think they could have been a little bit but I noticed they got really really comfortable on these kind of things here they're putting the extra comfort because you need it because they are flat and it is quite close to the ground you know sometimes when you wear flats it, they can maybe hurt your feet but also it can damage your feet as well so which you have to be careful so yeah i think this is really really nice but um this here was nine pounds for them so yeah i just thought i'd show you that so it comes in pink and it also comes in blue and it's a nice lovely you know bright color block as they say as well so yeah really really good you know me and my bright colors so I'm going to go on to the accessories. So I've picked up these glasses here. So I did get, how many? I've got another glasses I think here as well. And this one here was £1 for them. But um, I do like this one. It's kind of, it kind of goes round kind of thing, as you can see. So they're kind of like a... Um, B, B glasses, you know, well, if people understand what I'm talking, they know exactly what I'm talking about, but they kind of sculpt around your face, which is really good. So, yeah, this one here was only a pound. So I think this is a really good buy, you know, and it is still UV protection as well, which is a good thing to know as well. And I also picked up this one here as well. Um... This one here was one pound as well. So like I said, I didn't get much glasses because um, in my previous hauls, I, you notice I put in glasses and all the rest of it because there was a lot of glasses and I thought, let me just show you a lot of glasses. But this time I haven't got really that much glasses to show. And the ones that were available is, um, is what I showed already and all the rest of it but i didn't pick up these ones i don't think but this here is one pound as well and it's still uv protection as well um which is really good so one pound yeah because i noticed that your glasses are kind of gone up haven't they but 350 i'm just thinking oh you know but yeah there you go but um i picked up this one here this is a scarf I do like this one and this one was two pounds and I got it for one pound lovely scarf I like the color it's like leopard print so I bring it up closer it's like leopard print and it's got the 
um, bit of pink in it, which I thought this is nice, thought it was a good buy. And it also shows the pictures, how to use the scarf, how you want to wear it. So yeah, there's the little pictures if you want to see it. I'm going to show you the size of it because I'm definitely keeping this scarf because I always have a scarf. Maybe if it ain't for something else, but for the well, majority of the time, it's for the hair. Especially, you know, so that's that's the size of the scarf. So not bad, one pound. And yeah, it's quite good quality. It feels nice as well. So that was on sale. And um, I picked up this little glasses case here and this one was two pounds fifty um one thing is good about it yeah it's got good space in it but it also got the glasses cleaner for it because yeah you should really have glasses and have a little case but i saw this one and yeah that's it let me take that off and i'll show you properly but um that's the space inside of it and that is the pattern hold on let me close it and i'll show you but yeah that's how it looks and that's the back of it as well yeah so really good but i like the fact that it's got the glasses cleaner to cl clean the sunglasses or maybe if it's not for your sunglasses it could be just normal glasses which is good i like the fact that it's got this little um little loop here as well so i don't know if it oh it does so you can yeah well, I didn't realise. I thought, oh, maybe it does. But you can clip this on the side of your bag. On the, um, you know, maybe the bag strap or something. Or maybe if you don't want to and you want to just pull it inside your bag, you can. But it's got that part there where you can clip it on. And if you don't want it, you can always take it off if you get me. So it's really good for that. But £2.50. Yeah. What can I say? But it's a case that is is gonna be protecting the glasses. You know, if you buy glasses and it costs a one pound and the case costs two pound fifty, well, yeah, you you do the math. It, this costs more than the glasses, but um, some of them do cost two fifty to um three fifty and one pound as well. But um, I picked up this. I hope it's come up all right. I'll hold on. No. Nope. Yeah. You know when you take things out of the bag, it doesn't want to come out how it's supposed to come out. Hold on, where did this one come from? Alright, that one's there. I can't bother you now. You look up you lot can work it out, yeah? You, you can work it out. But anyway, this one here was a lovely necklace and it was three pounds fifty for it, which Mm, yeah, it's not bad anyway because yeah, that's how much it is three pound fifty for three chains But um, I do like the thing how it's got um two um tone in this one here and it's got like a little um Hope what do you call them? It's, I can't remember what you call them I don't know if it's a belcher because it's got the circle part in it But I can't remember what it's called if you know you can put it in the comments and yeah and tell me what the actual name is for it anyway but um i do like how it's got the silver chain and then it's got the gold chain on that so i think that is really nice and it's different i think i would just buy it just for that to be honest but the silver chain is is fine on this as well i bring it a bit closer and um the gold chain as well is all right as well i like the the links in them so it's really nice, but I think my favourite has to be this one. So yeah, it looks very, very nice. And for £3.50 for the set of three is really quite good. But I do like this quite a lot. That one is my favourite, I think, because it's very, very different. And I'll put that over there. And I picked up this little bag here. And this one is a little clutch bag. So it is very nice. I like the detail how it's got the little, you know, stitching around the side and over the the top of the bag. So I'm going to open it up and show you the space in it. And 
it comes with the strap already so you can if you don't you know like me i don't like to carry bag like this i just i can't do it you know i think with me i think i'll just leave the bag so this is a good cross um, cross body bag so which is really good you know so that's the size of the inside of the bag which is good and the strap and it also has the little um you know where you put your little money or your card in there as well so it's got that part there so yeah that is a really lovely bag i do like this a lot and this one here was nine pounds so it's a nice bag so if you want to if you're a person i like to carry bags like this it's, it's good for that but for me i can't i can't wear bags like that it's just it will start to annoy me and like i said i'm a person i might just leave it or if it's a bag that's on my wrist that's fine because i know it's there but um to carry it it's nice to have it like that but yeah for taking pictures and posing yeah it's an idle bag but like i say it's good that it's got the long strap for it but i do like this and it's not white actually it is a cream color so if it says it it says white but this looks like more of a cream color and i don't know if it's because i'm inside the house but i don't know what you lot think but they say it's white but to me that don't look white that looks more like a off-white cream so yeah that's the actual color to me yeah it's like a creamy white so that's it on this bag and i also picked up this other bag here as well it might be a bit too busy and all the rest of it but i thought i'd pick this one up and this one here was nine pounds for it as well but yeah, it's like nice for festival party. You know, if you've got wearing something plain, this will just say off. Oh, it's yeah, it's like that. But um, yeah, I know it's nine pounds and it's like like that. So yeah, that's how it is these days. It's things is not as cheap as what it is. It's not yesterday's price, as they say. Yeah, so that's the inside of the bag. It's lined, which is really good. And you can zip it back up as well. It hasn't got um, it hasn't got the actual next other pocket, which I think they should have put a little extra pocket in there. To be honest, you know, but um, yeah, it's like a little um, crochet bag. So and you can zip it back up. So which is good, and then you can close it. Yeah, so it's got that little magnetic, and you can put. You see, like this. I can have a bag like this it's around the wrist it's not bad but yeah this is nine pounds it might not be your sort of thing but i think this is nice you know like i said you could wear something plain and this will just say it off or you like a person like different colors this is not bad i like it actually they did have a bigger version of this bag but it's this is a clutch bag the other bag was like a normal bag i think that bag was um 12 pounds for it but i didn't pick it up obviously i picked up this because i thought oh this is a really quite nice colorful bag so yeah and it's yeah nice for you know maybe um going out to you know dinner or lunch or whatever but nice i like the colors just yeah screen summer that's what that's what we like to see summer yeah and i picked up these earrings here as well i really really fell in love with these earrings you know these are really nice i don't know if you can see it, but it's beaded earrings but it's like that and that's the back of them as well but i think these are really really lovely they are a bit more for them, but I think it's kind of worth it because how it is. So this is £3.50. I do like the detail. Just bring it up a bit closer so you can see. So that is it. Nice beaded earrings, but they're gold. But I think the, um, if it was anywhere else, I think this will be a hell of a lot more money for these earrings, to be honest. And I think you know it too. Maybe if you go to them big stores, three pounds fifty is quite, you know, it's still a bit much in Primark, but like I said, a lot of things is gone up. So yeah, it is what it is. So this is gold, but I think these are really pretty. 
really really pretty and like i said they look more than three pounds fifty for them yeah it looks like one of the big high streets kind of you know maybe like zara or something and you know it won't be three pound fifty for the earrings but i just thought i'd show you these ones um and uh, my last um earrings i picked up was this one here look at that that is so lovely i really love these earrings it's got um it's like it coming like it's got this kind of thing i don't like straw i don't know what you call this you know this um stuff yeah but like i say you can leave in the comment what it's called or it may be like rattan but it's not rattan if you get me but anyways yeah i really really like these earrings when i saw that i thought I have to get them i have to have to get them so i bring it up a bit closer but these earrings are really really pretty oh I'll tell you but um it clips in at the back there so you just open it up there and then you close it back which is good and it's got enough air space to put it put your ears through so which is good but this is lovely I really love these earrings a lot and yeah obviously I had to pick up the pink ones yeah but it came in the other color as well it came in um green so I just my eye just like okay, should I get the green ones or should I get the pink ones and I said no I'll pick up the pink ones um the green ones are oh, but this is so pretty I, I know i'm going on and on about these earrings but i'm so glad i picked them up so yeah so so happy but i do like the little gold beading detail on it and they look really expensive again but i like the fact that is i don't know if you can hear that yeah it's like that i don't think it's scratchy like that no it's not scratchy <laughs> yeah do the scratch test it's not bad on the skin actually but it is really nice i like the gold beading on it it's really pretty i do love these earrings um yeah they're nice three pounds fifty so i thought i'll treat myself to a pair of earrings so yeah that's it but um yeah there, there is that like, few other things yeah like i said yeah that they got out it's just like the Everything is just busy in Primark right now. So, there's so much things. But, um, yeah, that is it for today's video. Make sure you leave a comment. I do appreciate a lot of you are watching. Um, but make sure you're liking as well, as well as subscribing. So, yeah, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. I do really appreciate the old subscribers, as well as the new ones have that started on my channel as well as watching yeah stumbling so um yeah that is it for today i won't waffle on any further but um yeah you see me again tomorrow so look out for the video for tomorrow make sure your post notification is on so you better be ready for the next haul again so i'll see you till then take care now bye